Collie Center. It's starting to rain on me, so I gotta train in a place where I can make this video, protect the camera from the rain. But uh, I wanna go ahead and uh, get this little double sticks drill in for you. So grab your double sticks, hit the subscribe button, smash that thumbs up button, out here training in the rain for you guys. I do this all the time anyways. Let's go ahead and grab our gear, let's get training. All right, today's training for the double stakes, we're taking a look at some of the basic techniques. And uh, let's go ahead and just kind of get a few drills together. And then we'll put them together and this is going to help to develop some more coordination and flow between more transitions between different techniques. All right, so let's go ahead and break it down. We've got three drills and then we'll go ahead and put them all together into one flow drill. So drill number one, we're going to start off right here in the open position. I've uh, realized that in the last few double stick videos, we've been starting everything in the chamber position, and I want to make sure that you guys have, you know, different techniques and different drills and skills out of the different positions of the double weapons. So we're going to start off right here in the open position. We're going to slash our number one, and then we're going to thrust the backhand, and then we're going to flip it and slash on the two. We're going to repeat the same thing on the left hand side. So we're going to slash that one thrust the backhand, and then flip it and slash the number two. So this first drill, it's a six count drill. So we have one, two, three, four, five, and six strikes right here. So one, two, three, four, five, and six right here. Let's do a couple of reps together. It's a pretty simple one. So let's just get like two reps in together here. Right here, starting with the right hand. Slash the one. There's that backhand thrust. Flip it to the two and slash that two. Left hand, same thing. Slash the one. There's that backhand thrust and there's the number two. Let's do it two more times nice and slow together. One, thrust, two. Left hand, one, thrust, two. Back to the right hand. One, two, three, four, five and six. So again, this one's not too difficult, but as always, just start off nice and slow. Okay? When we start everything off slowly, this allows us to build good solid coordination, making sure we have good solid striking mechanics, good technique, and good form. So the wind is picking up a little bit, so I do apologize if it's a little windy here. But I wanna make sure you guys get your training in. So let's go on to drill number two. We're gonna start off on the low position. So you can even start here in the open position and then you can go into this uppercut motion. Or sometimes you might be in that three position or something and then you can also start from there. So I'm gonna go ahead and just kinda of start it from the uppercut position right here. We're gonna strike our number three and then our number four and then forehand thrust, and then flip it. Same thing on the left hand side, we're gonna strike our three, up to four, and then forehand thrust, and then flip it, right here. All right. So from here, once again, right hand, we got the angle three, up the angle four, forehand thrust. Left hand up the angle three, up the angle four, forehand thrust, right here. So three, four, thrust, three, four and thrust. Let's get a couple of these in together. Nice and slow right here. Starting with the right hand. Right hand, angle three, up the four, and thrust. Bring it back. Left hand, up the three, up the four, thrust. Bring it back. Once again, we have one, two, three strikes on the right, four, five, through six strikes on the left. One, two, three, four, five, and six, right there. So slash, slash, and thrust, slash, slash, and thrust, right there. The third drill that we have for this little mini-series 
is our single weave. We call this a single weave, or it's also sometimes known as the single sinawali, because we weave our arms, we weave the sticks one time. So our single weave, I've done a few videos on this, but I'll go ahead and break it down right here for you as well. We're gonna start off in that open position, and I'm gonna strike my one on my right, and strike my one on my left. Notice how that crosses the arms into the closed position. I strike the two on the right, and then the two on the left, and that uncrosses the arms, and they've weaved one time. So we have our one, our one, our two, and our two. One, one, two, two. So you're basically crossing your arms and then uncrossing your arms for our single weave or our single sinawali. Let's go ahead and do a couple single weaves together, nice and slow. From right here, starting off with the right hand, striking our one, left hand striking our one, right hand striking our two, left hand striking our two. Again, one on the right, one on the left, two on the right, two on the left. Again, one, one, two, and two. One, one, two, and two. Right, once we have all three drills down individually, it's really a good idea to make sure that you train them individually. It's going to help out a lot to start building that coordination. Let's start building some flow between these three drills. So let's go ahead and put them all together into a quick uh, little kind of mega flow drill right here. So we just go in chronological order. We're going to start off with the first drill, okay, and right into the second drill. It, right into the third drill of the single weave. And then it starts all over again, back into the first drill. Back into the second drill. All right, that's our slash, slash and thrust. And then back into the third drill of the single weave right here. So we have one, two, and three. Give that one a go, work that out. Three different drills, put them all together and then you basically got four drills. I'm gonna do some more extended drills on this for our sponsors here on our channel. So if you wanna get access to that training, to those videos as well, click the join button right below this video and check out becoming a sponsor of the channel so you can get that training plus a whole bunch of exclusive training videos that we have here on the channel, only available for our sponsors. If you like training the double sticks, go ahead and smash that thumbs up button for me real quick. Leave me a cool comment below. If you're new to the channel or you've been watching and you haven't yet, just click that subscribe button for me real quick. It helps me out when you're showing that type of support here to the channel. I appreciate it and uh, you know it just kind of helps to keep these things coming to your way and keep you training. Now get on outside, whatever the weather is. It's kind of on and off rain right now and getting windy and all that craziness and I'm out here training so never have an excuse not to train or a reason not to train just get out there and go get it done so every single day you're making progress in your collie all right I'll see you guys back here for another video very soon later